Hey guys, this is John from Wampler, back in the shop again today. And today I'm gonna paint a lipless. I'm gonna be doing the golden shad. And what I did already was uh, went in with some white, then uh, pearl white, then black. Then I'm gonna get my uh, my scale pattern over there. And I'm gonna, we're gonna do the scales real quick. Give me just one second. The key to the, the scaling is, is uh, make sure your scales are tight and you don't want it to move. So I usually put something heavy down here to hold it in place, like a couple bottles or whatever. Works best for you, but that's how I do it. We'll load up some light real fast. Camera pressure down a little, a little high. I'm just going to do the scales real quick. I got this lipless uh, crankbait over at uh, James Ganone over at Lower Build. They wash my gun out real fast. Okay, we're back. I washed out my gun. And the next color we're going to spray is we're going to spray some uh, pearlized gold. And uh, we already did the white. I'm just going to spray over top of the white at an angle real lightly. You don't want to blast it because it can run underneath your scales and you don't want that. So it's real lightly. Wash my gun out real fast. Hey guys, I'm back. I washed my gun out. I went ahead and sprayed this other, uh, the other uh, side. Uh, but I, all, all I did was just spray my white over my black, then went back in with uh, the pearlized gold. So I'm just gonna take this off and I'll show you how I do all of my other details and stuff like that. That's what you get after you do your skills. I'm gonna go in and fix a couple places real fast. My pressure touch. I'm gonna get my art tool stencil here. I'm gonna load up a little bit of carbon black real fast. Okay, let me wash my gun out real fast. All right, I'm back, I washed my gun out. And uh, my next step is what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uh, load up some, uh, some sepia real fast into my gun and we're gonna do some detail. Real lightly. Go to the other side.
All right, let me smoke in that real fast. All right, I'm back. Just gonna add a little bit of molded into my gill area a little bit. Just gives a little bit of extra contrast. Pulling up some white now. So about the compressor guys all i'm doing is just adding uh some white over some of my uh detail that i did in black the other side real fast <clears throat> Doing my sad dot now. Give me just one second. The mother side real fast. I'm going to real fast. All right, we're back. Uh, all I did was just spray some white in this little shad dot thing here. I'm just going to go in with some black to give it like a highlight. That's what you get. Gives it some depth in your shads. I like doing it. Go to the other side. Hope you guys enjoy the video. All right, we're gonna put some eyes in that I got from uh, Lower Bill, and they're like the realistic eyes. I hope you guys enjoy the video. I know it's kind of a short one, but this shade don't take too long to paint. The other side, <clears throat> but yeah, Jimmy, he's got some cool eyes, guys. If you like uh, doing realistic lowers like I do. Uh, He's got some nice realistic eyes over there on the lower build. I know a lot of you guys have been wanting me to do this for a while, so I figured I'd get one in. It's been a while since I did a video. Hope you guys like the video. But uh, I'll try to uh, do a video in about a week or so. But uh, there, there it is, guys, the, the Golden Shad. I'll catch y'all next time. Later.